What's up you guys, it's Kalen from Game for Pancakes and today I have another Minecraft tutorial video. I am back in my tutorial world, so last time I did a tutorial I did this trash can system kind of thing. I can't I still haven't had like an official name for it, but today I'm gonna to do something kinda of simple. It's gonna be the cobblestone generator. Now what a cobblestone generator does is it takes a, wa a water stream and a lava stream and if you've noticed in the work like randomly in the in survival uh, you'll come across some places where water and lava come together and they'll form cobblestone and they'll also form obsidian now the trick is to not form the obsidian one because that one is also really really easy to make so let's so what you do to make the obsidian one on accident is you put a lava here and a water here and it'll automatically just come over here and get to the lava now what you want to do is let's see see I got rid of that now what you want to do is you also you always want to have a place for the water to go into so that it doesn't just keep going so if I say put a hole right here then I can put the water there and the lava there and then boom cobblestone now you can just easily mine this and get cobblestone and this is really good for survival games um, not survival games oh well, maybe I don't know um, definitely um, I think Sky Island or whatever it's called I don't play multiplayer very much but I use it all the time when I'm just building stuff in my world so that is the simplest way of doing it now I have a couple other ideas so this one is kind of a glamorous one so it's basically the same concept but just like a lot flashier so what you do is you just build say a platform of like three by what is this seven sorry yeah I think it's seven okay and then what you do is you dig out the four space that you'd need just like make it fancy over here you just like keep it even and then you put the water there lava there makes cobblestone there and then there's something like that and then you can do like a like a canopy or like a roof above it you can put torches up make it all fancy this is um, this one is the one I have currently in my world just to be like fancy so it's like a like a well or something and then this one is kind of um, a really big use of space but um, I do find that if you're like really impatient and you don't like the waiting like the three seconds for it to for the cobblestone to regenerate so there is like like a, a half second to three second delay in between each cobblestone like regenerating so this one is kind of a big use of your hello again it is so I went and counted, I dug the hole, it is 7 by 7, not 5 by 5, don't listen to me, don't, you don't listen to me, I'm not very smart most of the time. So, so what you do is you do the 7 by 7 upper square, and then what you do is you do the 5 by 5 lower square. Now this, um, as you can tell, or if you can remember from my earlier explanation, that is where the water will run into. So now let me just get some like a cobble like a three by three cobblestone place for the lava to sit in the middle here. Boom, like that. Now, now so that that just uh, brings it up above the water line, and then that brings it to the water line. So if I put the lava there, so these four cobblestone will actually be where the cobblestone will regrow back. So let's just put some water on the outside and boom so now you have an identical thing so as you can see let me quickly uh, stand right here so what you can do if you're skilled enough is you just walk in a circle and you just keep getting cobblestone the trick is to not run into the water or else that'll happen 
Sometimes the cobblestone will knock you back if the cobblestone grows back fast enough, but I do find that you could get at least two cobblestone per before they both grow back. And then if you wanted to get like really, really complex, you could, ha you could always have a hopper underneath all these like um, cobblestone generators so that they don't accidentally like get destroyed in the lava or something so let me quickly get into survival really quick so watch if you just keep mining the cobblestone and you don't have to stand near it you don't have to collect it it won't go into the lava it'll just keep going into the hopper now I believe that was six that was seven so all seven of those just went into the hopper nothing was lost and it's a pretty efficient way to do things so that is pretty much it for the tutorial now that it's about to get nighttime. So thank you guys for watching Game of Pancakes. Hopefully you found this tutorial helpful and I will hopefully be uploading more tutorials very soon. Bye bye.